Today I'm here to share with you uh, seven shades of human therapy, which I have named it as rainbow shades of uh, human therapy. Day before yesterday, you, you must have heard of a famous tweet. It says, one man's tweet is another man's poison pill. I hope you know what I'm referring to. The possible takeover of Twitter by Elon Musk. Humor can also be seen in the obituary message. When Steve Jobs died, Amul came up with a cartoon. The cartoon was I gone instead of iPhone. Three apples have transformed the world was a message. One was Adam's apple, second was Newton's apple, third was Steve Jobs' apple. The way we communicate even a tribute message or an obituary can also turn into a humorous situation. Let's have the first line. This is the humor based on quotes. There are so many quotes where humor is applied. I have chosen a few quotes. How Churchill explained golf. He explained golf as a game whose aim is to hit a very small ball into an even smaller hole with weapons singularly ill-designed for this purpose. Since he didn't like golf, he described golf in this way. And of course, uh, a pessimist looks for a calamity in every opportunity, while an optimist looks for opportunity in every calamity. And uh, of course, a famous quote by Agatha Christie, an archaeologist is the best husband a woman can ever have. The older she gets, the more interested he is in her. <laughs> Next. Now, let me give you an example for uh, presence of mind. Before that, you should know one thing. Starting from Mahatma Gandhi, uh, Pooja Gurudev, R.K. Lakshman, all are known for humor. Situational humor is what all are known for. Shakespeare's Macbeth is widely known as a tragedy, but there is a, a comic interlude in Macbeth called Knocking at the Gates of Hell, which is still being studied for Shakespeare's expertise in humor. Here are some examples for uh, presence of mind. A man once went to a doctor and said, uh, when I have dreams, uh, I have rats playing football, what to do? The doctor gave a medicine. He was a psychiatrist and said, take this medicine. The patient said, can I take the medicine after two days? When the doctor asked, the patient said, tomorrow is semi-final and day after is final. Humor is situation. Now, here are some examples. Difference bit between Kuldeep Singh and Mahatma Gandhi. Mahatma Gandhi was a right-arm spinner. Kuldeep Singh is a left-arm spinner. Difference between a car and a tree. A car leaves the shed, the tree sheds the leaves. I asked this question between Air India and Indian Airlines, expecting that the child would answer one is domestic, the other is international. The answer I got was stunning. One child said, so one is loss making, the other is profit making. <laughs> Difference between a teacher and a locomotive driver. The teacher trains the mind, the locomotive mind, the driver minds the train. Next, let's move on to the next one. Uh, sometimes, you know, if we make a mistake, we can make a humor out of it. Here are some examples. I have given so many examples. Uh, 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 no barking in front of gate instead of parking. An idea can change your wife in place of life. So many examples are there. Welcome to Vivo IPL virtual ghost box. A Japanese commander once gave a command to his uh, soldiers, observe a minute silence till the VIP passes away instead of passes by. A teacher once asked a child, if earth rotates 30 times as fast as it does, what will happen? The child answered immediately, in that case, ma'am, you will get your salary every day. <laughs> Another teacher asked, why is it that John has only three fingers in his hand? The child said, yesterday John put his hand into the mouth of a horse to count how many teeth the horse had. And unfortunately, the horse closed its mouth to count how many fingers John had. <laughs> a history teacher takes the ch children for a tour and children see two skulls, one small skull and one big skull. The teacher says that uh, the big skull was a skull of Julius Caesar and then the student asks whose skull is small, small skull. The teacher says without hesitation that was a skull of Julius Caesar when he was a small boy. All of you must have heard of an incident which involves uh, Milka Singh. Uh, one day uh, after the event um, uh, he was uh, resting and a European journalist asked him are you relaxing? He said no, I am Milka Singh. George Bernard Shaw was asked by somebody, which book has given you the maximum profit without hesitation? He said, my checkbook. Uh, one example for a situation of humor is when the Martyrs Day celebration was going on, I was connecting it with, I was on the other side. I told Reno, be on your toes. I heard that she stood on the toes. Now let's move on. Uh, comedy of errors has no end. Uh, once uh, in an award ceremony, someone read, it's my uh, horror to invite Hitchcock to receive the award instead of honor. The best comedy which I have ever come across is this. A lady biographer wrote 
the history of Napoleon, the biography of Napoleon. She wrote Napoleon was a great soldier, a great commander, a great statesman. And finally, she was able to write, in short, he is an attractive personality. By mistake, she wrote, in short, he is an interesting personality. <laughs> These are some definitions. These are some definitions I have given courtesy in Jodianian video. A man goes to a restaurant and asks, give me a plate of typical South Indian delicacy that is circular and fluffy, smeared with a spoonful of nanoparticles of chili powder. What he asked was Bodhi Idli. That's it. Committee. We define committee as a group of people, great people who come together and prove that no work can be done together. Doctor. The one who kills your ills by his pills and finally kills you with his pills. Cow. A factory which converts grass into milk. Economist is the one who knows more about money than the one who has it. Skeleton, the one who forgot, who went on a diet and forgot to stop it. Father, the banker provided by nature. Some amusing newspaper headlines are there. I'll give you two. Don Bradman scored a century and uh, Australia was able to defeat Western Indies. One British newspaper came up with the caption. Bradman conquers England with bat, which Hitler couldn't do with his Air Force. Sachin. Tendulkar scored 100 runs and the man of the match award was presented by a man called Professor Diyodar. He lived up to 101, but at that time he was 99. Hindu came up with the headline, Sachin 100 not out, Professor Diyodar 99 not out. <laughs> the last one, uh, humor can be a response to a question. Is brain transplantation surgery successful? The question was asked, a doctor replied, yes, it is a successful one, but the patient will not be alive. Churchill was giving a speech in the parliament, a lady from Labour Party, opposition party said, had I been your wife, I would have given you poison. Churchill said, had I been your husband, I would have taken the poison. <laughs> Inadvertent reply, a man died, uh, he was buried, his wife came back home and, and, and he, she wanted to check the inbox to see whether people had sent any condolence message. On the same day, another man the same name went to Chicago. He sent a mail to his wife stating that he has reached Ch Ch Chicago. That mail reached this lady who lost her husband. This is the situation, I will read the mail. Just see how much shock the person would have undergone. Subject reached. Dear sweetheart Rosalie, I have reached my destination. What he meant was Chicago, but this is read by a, a wife who has lost her husband. The journey was pleasant and eventful. Surroundings are speak and span. They have made us all possible arrangements to make me stay comfortable. I look forward to your arrival. <laughs> The okay, last one, I will end with a, I will end with a humor in poem, a poem written by a student in a book known as a student today. I have to study physics with its variation, chemistry with its equation, accountancy with its calculation, English with its punctuation, history with its civilization, geography with its plantation, and economics with its population. Hence, there is no time for relaxation. Thank you.